Okay guys, hey, I got the uh, Recon, getting ready to take it back out. This is a plane I worked on quite a while ago. It features the KFM-2 airfoil. Um, Dick Klein actually helped me with the, uh, kind of the idea for this plane, and he actually made the logo for this plane uh, called the Recon. <laughs> so he made the logo for that. Getting ready to take it back up. I'm doing some range testing with the FPV camera. Um, we got to connect it to a little TV over there, pointed at John Tim. Uh, I need to do some modifications because it's a little too bright out here, so you can't really see the TV. So we probably won't uh, fly with that, but we're just going to do some range tests. So I also got the HD camera in the uh, recon, so we'll get some HD footage in the air. Do you guys see anything? Yeah. I'll do a couple rounds and we'll do some range so tests. This is the 900 megahertz FPV system from uh, Hobby King. I think it's only 200 milliwatts though, so it's just a smaller system. Um, I got this way back when they first came out. So uh, we'll probably be getting a more high powered system later. But this is just some trial runs to test out to see how it works. Can you guys see still? Yeah. So we still got reception? Yeah, like I said, this is only the 200 milliwatt, right 900 megahertz one. I flew the 100 milliwatt 2.4. It's pretty clear, man. I mean, is it? There, you lost it. Okay, yeah, I'm behind the building. That's okay. Funny. Tell me you can see it now. <laughs> oh, it's, yeah, it's gone. No signal oh, we got. Gone. Which one of these things you got to move, Paul? The black one? The bit, yeah. It doesn't have the right force. It was back in my phone. Yeah, I need to get the right side plug for that. Or something.
Yeah, so far so good knock on wood. I don't feel any uh, disturbance with the radio. Hello, Winsock. Damn guys. So far, so good. Knock on wood. I don't feel any disturbance with the 900 right megahertz. Still so flies the same to you? Yeah. Nice and stable? Never yeah. Bad right mm -hmm. You had a bad signal loss on that far end. Out here to the Bermuda Triangle. Mm -hmm. Get another low pass. Good job. Okay, that's uh, the uh, pretty much the test. Let's talk to these guys. They were looking at the uh, little TV I got hooked up over here. Um, like I said, it's a little too bright out here, so I'm gonna have to build a bigger, longer box on it. Uh, but that, or I might get some goggles here in a little bit in the future. Hey guys, what'd you guys think about the camera footage? How was it working? Oh, it looked really good. It looked really good. So you're getting a couple interferences on both ends okay. this way. Yeah, it was at maximum range at that point. And okay, yeah. So the 200 milliwatt. Um, 900 megahertz doesn't have a whole lot of range at least the way we have the antenna set up I mean, if we get bigger better antennas it'll probably have better range yeah so. uh, the biggest problem with the view was getting the TV light pan around here <laughs> can you see is uh, the TV even on still we grabbed a sweater and a bandana out of the car <laughs> and threw that over it and draped that over can our head in there uh, there's oh, no oh. signal right now Hold on. tell me when you got it back. we're having a cable problem there it is here we go oh, right I lost there. it again lost it again yeah tell me when yeah I need the correct plug there it there is we go. Okay. there's our feet mm -hmm. okay so basically, I got a little TV in there that has a built-in LiPo battery um, that runs by itself, and I'm running the um, receiver okay, off here. of a LiPo battery also. Pan down, down here, Tom. Right here. This is just a real quick setup. I threw it together in about five minutes. So um, eventually, I'm going to get a bigger, better antenna, and hopefully we can get more range and possibly a better uh, transmitter for the camera. Okay, guys, that's the recon. <laughs> Pan over here. That's cool. Okay guys, we finished flying the recon at Herman Airport, now we're kind of back in the house and I just want to give you a real kind of a quick look at uh, where the recon's at. It's definitely a work in progress still, I have quite a bit of work to do, uh, but basically the original idea was kind of to create a small UAV um, with a KF airfoil and that was kind of after the conversations I had with Dick Klein. So basically this plane has a 72 inch wingspan with a uh, KF M2 airfoil on it. Um, basically the video you just saw, all the uh, video from the air was from the uh, Contour HD camera. This is the HD uh, helmet cam that got mounted in the nose. Um, none of the wireless video was recorded so we didn't really have any of that to show in the video. Um, but basically that's just a um, basic uh, 900 megahertz 200 milliwatt system that I got off of Hobby King 
Um, I'm just doing some experiments with that. I'll probably get a lot better setup later on in the future. Um, but basically, that's where the recon's at. Uh, hopefully, we'll get some uh, more flights with it. Uh, probably do some upgraded equipment later and uh, do some more testing with it. Here's just a quick shot of the TV I had mounted on the tripod. It has a pretty cool little tripod screw mount on the bottom. Um, you just screw on and mount to the tripod. Um, the TV wasn't really bright enough to use in direct sunlight, so I tried just putting a real quick box around it, but it's still, the backlighting still got in and, and still made it uh, kind of washed out, so you couldn't really see the screen. So that was just kind of a little experiment. I wanted to use it because this uh, little TV has a built-in LiPo battery, so it's totally portable and uh, easy to set up. But um, I'll probably get, get some... Uh, FPV goggles in the future. Um, here's the receiver for the video, wireless video. That's the 900 megahertz receiver. And I'll just run that off of a uh, 3S LiPo pack. So basically I had kind of some problems with the uh, plug here. I don't have the correct plug, so the connection wasn't that great. So it was kind of cutting out on uh, John, Tim, and Frank when they were watching it. So I got to get that fixed up and uh, figured out, and then uh, hopefully we'll get out for some more testing. Okay, everyone, that's pretty much going to be the end of the video for the recon this week. Thanks for joining me for this video. Um, got some more EPP projects that I'm going to be working on soon in the future. So stay tuned. More stuff coming out from RC Film Fighters.